going on, family? Peace and infinite blessings. It's your girl, Isis Love, just riding around and I'm getting it. <laughs> Enjoying this beautiful, beautiful weather here in Georgia today. Uh, but I wanted to do a quick video because um, a lot of keep, people keep saying, you know, happy holidays and, you know, happy Thanksgiving and all of that stuff, right? But I don't celebrate Thanksgiving, right? I'm not going to celebrate the day that made the Europeans, right, come over to our lands, right, and rape and kill our people, right? So Thanksgiving was supposed to be when um, the Native Americans, you know, basically broke bread and broke peace with uh, the colonizers that came to America, right? So we we uh, most of us celebrate Thanksgiving, not even knowing why we celebrate Thanksgiving, right? It's just our parents did it, our parents' parents did it, our grandmas do it, the rest of society's doing it. So we just all follow along, and we just all celebrate Thanksgiving, not even really knowing what the holiday is for, right? And so I always say, you know, why does it take a holiday? Or a day, one day for us to take the time out and spend with our family. So most people might be like, well, I only celebrate it because I like to come together with my family, right? Family should be, we should be together always. It shouldn't take some special day that society has put out there to say this is the day that you give thanks. We should be giving thanks all day, every day, right? Every day should be thanksgiving right not just not special today what you don't even realize is that these holidays are a great time for people to make money right these holidays if you ever pay attention every month is a holiday every month is a holiday every month they are coming at you so you can spend your hard-earned money every month guess what it was just trick-or-treating the day after trick-or-treating, they already had Thanksgiving and Christmas stuff up, right? Right after Thanksgiving, and guess what? It's going to come Christmas. Then right after Christmas, we got New Year's, right? Then right after that, we got Valentine's Day, right? Pay attention to the cycles, right? It's a program that just keeps going over and over, and we're so programmed to just celebrate these holidays, not even knowing what they really are. So I urge you especially indigenous people especially people of color especially people from the latino communities indigenous people i really urge you to see what the meaning of thanksgiving really is because all of our native american brothers and sisters who have walked this land before us way before us are probably turning in their grave to know that their descendants are, are, are celebrating a holiday on the day they got slaughtered and killed. Do you guys know what Christopher Columbus and his crew did to the Native American people? Do you think they came there for some type of peace? No, they came there to conquer and destroy because that's how it always goes down, right? Conquering and destroying. Coming into countries, pushing the Bible on people, making people forget about the culture that they already have and then pushes their culture onto people right you need to really 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 go reevaluate and see what thanksgiving is about that's first and foremost second of all you need to really ask yourself why do i have to get with my family one time a year to eat you should always going to be going to go visit your family to go eat and go chill and get together once again, why does it take a special day, quote unquote special day, that society has put out there for you to go view, go go see your people? Have the people in your family you don't even like. And you just going just because it's Thanksgiving. Right? So you need to really ask yourself, are you why are you celebrating Thanksgiving? Are you doing it just because you're in a loop rat race of everybody else? See, most of us do things on autopilot. We don't even think. We just do it on Isle Pilot. Oh, well, everybody else is selling braiding this, so I'm just going to do it too, right? 
be a leader, not a follower, right? Don't follow the flock. Because nine times out of ten, if you're following the herd or following the flock, they're going the wrong way, right? They're going the wrong way. So today, I urge you to look at the true meaning of Thanksgiving, right? And then I want you to pay homage for the ancestors that came before you. All our Native American uh, family members who died, right, that was slaughtered on Thanksgiving, how about you give them some love and praise, right? Because without them being here and without them walking this walk before we walked it, we wouldn't even be here. So on Thanksgiving, give, give thanks and praise to the people who came before us. Give thanks and praise to all the Native American people that died on that day right so if you're gonna celebrate thanksgiving celebrate it for our ancestors right don't celebrate it because people came and raped the land and raped our people right celebrate thanksgiving if you're gonna celebrate it um paying homage for all of our native american brothers and sisters that walked here before us okay so i'm not gonna go really too deep um into it but i highly recommend you do your own research because the rabbit hole goes deep but I, I highly recommend you check it out, right? So nobody don't put Happy Thanksgiving on my page or say Happy Thanksgiving because I do not celebrate Thanksgiving. I'm thankful every day that I wake up. Every day that I wake up, I am thankful. So I don't need a special day to let me know how thankful I am. And I don't need a special day to let me know how thankful I am for my family, my family members, right? So it's been a pleasure dropping these jewels on you real quick but like i said especially people of color indigenous people you need to really think twice before you sit down and celebrate thanksgiving and if you're going to celebrate it you need to at least celebrate it being being awoke being woke onto what really thanksgiving is all right so it's been a pleasure i'll be coming at you with the christmas holiday as well because that's another holiday that was not here for indigenous people when i say indigenous people i mean the root race people when i say the root race people i mean people that are indigenous to the americas people that are indigenous to africa indigenous people in mexico and in colombia indigenous people right we did not have christmas before right because we were not christian christianity came from the europeans we are so far away from the truth because we are listening to allegories. The Bible is a whole bunch of allegories. Now, I'm not saying that the Bible is not one to read. The Bible is a great resource to read, especially if you know how to read it. But if you just read the Bible just to read it word for word and you're believing everything that's in the Bible, then you're not reading it right. You're not decoding it right. The Bible is a whole bunch of... Um, decoded messages that you got to know how to read to really get the message right so i highly recommend all of my quote-unquote african-american people i highly recommend that you start checking out african culture start checking out pan-africanism start getting back to our ways of how we used to think do things before we were colonialized by the europeans okay so no disrespect to my european uh brothers and sisters but, you know, the truth is the truth. And um, history is his, his story, right? So we got to make it a new story, family. We have to change the way we, we do things. And we have to expand our mind, right? You just can't do what everybody else is doing just because, right? That's, no, you never go anywhere far like that in life. You have to be your own individual. And you have to do the work. And you have to do the research, all right? So peace love and light family see the description of this video for links to trade nation university and trade nation global where you can learn how to become a skilled forex trader successfully earning profits and creating generational wealth don't forget to share and like this video also remember to subscribe to the channel to get notifications on my new videos peace love and prosperity family